from the east to the west to the north to the south who this is man it's your man Popolo Mo'i here I hope you guys are doing good having a great morning we got a video for you guys man and um it's not just a video it's a lot of people talking about June and July June and July I don't know what's gonna happen I'm gonna be honest with you but if all these millionaires are talking about something that's gonna happen this summer then they know something I told y'all in 2021 this would be one of the worst years ever. I told y'all that. Now what if the aliens actually did come in June? Or July? All the rich are trying to escape by July. So what's going to happen in June? Will Jesus take his people away? And then proceed to judgment? Nothing happens without Jesus taking his people away. The rapture will happen first. That's why only a little people know. The little people that God is going to take. They're ready. They're looking at Jesus right now talking about, why aren't you here yet? And Jesus is talking about, well, I tried to save some more people. What's going to happen in June and July, bro? This young man, the Amazon's founder or CEO, or fa no, founder, will be leaving Earth in July. One of the first people to leave in July. They want to give us this explanation that it's about exploring. It's about no, bro. The rich are leaving America. And if they can't leave America, they're buying bunkers. They're, they're making bunkers. Like, once this shit actually hits the fan, bro, a lot of y'all aren't gonna survive, man. A lot of us aren't gonna survive. A lot of y'all ain't gonna survive. I ain't gonna put that out there. I'm gonna try to survive all the way until the end, until Jesus comes back, bro. I will endure to the end. I got to. Because I chose not to endure now. So I definitely got to then. Just imagine if we get left behind. And Jesus literally can't came in June and July. I just feel like saying, forgive me, Jesus, so much. Forgive me for being so prideful. Forgive me for being so arrogant. For choosing my way over your way. Because he's real, bro. And once he comes, bro. Oh. It's going to be up, bro. For everybody. Every single last person. That's why I tell Americans, bro, y'all in the y'all in the wrong place right now. Y'all in the wrong mindset right now. If you can't look at your brother, your neighbor, and say, "I will protect you. I will help you. I will help you get through whatever you're gonna go through," and you don't even gotta say that. Just just love your neighbor as you would yourself. But your neighbor's white, oh, so you don't like him. Or your neighbor's black or Mexican, so you don't like him. You fool with this racist pride, this racist, this, this racist hatred. None of you are gonna make it. All you people that claim to know Jesus, and and, and I can't wait to to y'all. I I will not say burn. I cannot wait to y'all meet Jesus for who he is. Your ancestors met Jesus for who he was, and y'all will get the same treatment that they got. That's the only thing as a black man that I feel proud about with these, with those white owners of slavery back in those times. That I know not one of them made it to heaven. If they treated their slaves the way that um, <clears throat> was depicted in history. And any white man or any white woman that went and bombed and killed and massacred black men, they are not in heaven. That gives me peace and hope because they were their father, the devil. But it's up for us to choose right now. Who are we going to choose? Jesus or the devil, bro? Because it's here. And it's who are you going to choose? Jesus Christ, the King of Kings, Lord of Lords, or Satan? If you get left behind, it's over, my man. If we get left behind, we will have to fight tooth and nail. Grown men shitting themselves. Why? Because demons are walking on the earth. Aliens are kidnapping people. 
Bro, this is not a movie. I told y'all 2021 would be one of the worst years ever, bro. <clears throat> Are the aliens coming in June or July? Who knows? But without Jesus Christ, you cannot survive. So repent of your sins. You know, and that's for me too. I got so much pride against Jesus. Like when I see other Christians doing what they're supposed to be doing, I, I get mad at God and I be like, well, you chose them and not me. So, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. And that's not true, man. It's just that, that pride inside that I don't want to submit to God because um, all the wrongs of the past, all the times missed. And again, it's just pride, me getting in the way of Jesus Christ. And I got to get that out of here because if I get left behind, it's a, it's a rap boy. You know what I mean? It's a rap. I hope y'all are having a blessed one. Just remember, whatever happens in June and July, if we're not ready, we will be swept away. If you're not in Christ, you will be swept away. That's that's for sure. So, stay blessed, stay up. <clears throat>